Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Khadija LaBelle. So today I'm going to be doing a Q&A about myself just so you guys can get to know me a little better. So I made a post on my story yesterday for questions for people to ask me and these are what they came up with. So I'm just going to answer the questions that were asked me. I thought that would be a little more personal but they're kind of more broad. So let me just go with one of the first questions I have here. Would you rather do runway or print? Okay, so sometimes I model and I post pictures and I've done a lot of print modeling, not so much runway modeling. So I would say I love print and I think it's easier to edit and less perfection that has to go into it because I don't know, it's just, there's more room for error. Whereas runway, you have to, it's on the spot and like live. So it's kind of more pressure, but I want to do more runway. Cause I just like, do you ever just walk in a room and then, or just walk in an empty hall and just like stride? I love that feeling. So I think I want to do more runway, but I do love print. So I guess I can't really decide. The second question is what is my zodiac? So I am a Scorpio. My birthday is 11-11, the 11th of November. And I just feel like we're the best sign. I got this question a lot. It's where do you see yourself in five years? So in five years, I will be uh, 26. So I, I feel like this is a kind of a scary question because like we always think we're gonna be where we wanna be. And I really, 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 really hope that I end up where I want to be. So at 26, I think I will be living in a home. I don't know. Basically just living life, not struggling, not trying to, not hating my job. Just loving what I do and living hopefully out the country. But basically in five years, I just want to see myself enjoying life and living to the best of my ability. Deep sea diving or diving out of a plane. So if you know me, one of my biggest fears is being in the ocean because it's just so much that we haven't discovered and it's just kind of scary to think about that there is so much that is unknown in the ocean. But then again, diving, but diving out of a plane, everybody always says that skydiving is like one of the most best experience ever. And I'm a scared of all that. I'm scared of bungee jumping. I'm scared of skydiving. I'm scared of all that. But I really do want to skydive because I just want to get that feeling that everybody thinks. Like being in a near-death experience must be like so much bliss or something because people describe it as the best feeling ever. And I want to experience that. So skydiving. But somebody would literally have to push me out the plane because that is so scary. But I want to do it. I don't know. Is there anything y'all have like that where it's just like, I want to do this so bad, but I'm so scared. Like, fear is never my reason not to do something, but skydiving is something different. Like, I want to do that, but I cannot jump out of a plane. I cannot look down at the rest of the world and just jump to my death. The next question is, what is a food that you could eat every single day? So, a food I could eat every day, something every single day. If I have to eat something every single day, it would probably be crab legs crab legs itself don't bust but like crab legs dipped in some sauce preferably juicy crab sauce even though everybody thinks that juicy crab let itself go or whatever it's so good because it's not like extremely filling it just keeps you content and it tastes good like i think crab legs but i like vegetables maybe vegetables because i don't get i don't get that sick feeling when i eat vegetables or like overwhelmed feeling but maybe crab legs. I think crab legs, that's the answer I'm going to go with. What are your goals for the next three months? So right now it is February, February 28th. And we have March, January, February, March, April, May. So by May, I want to have had um, an upload on this channel every single week. At least once a week. Um, financially, I want to have way more money than I have now. And basically, I just want to shoot more towards my goals. My major is communication, so I hopefully want to do some internships and everything. Basically, just work on myself. More of my professional aspect, more of my entrepreneurship aspect, basically, to be more established and more consistent. Because clearly, I have a problem with consistency. If you just see my past few uploads, I'm not consistent. I don't know, but I'm trying to be more consistent. So having, um, having a post every week on this channel will be a major goal of mine. If you could change anything about the world, what would it be? If I could change anything about the world, it would probably be to make people more understanding. 
I feel like just b being black in general, they're often misunderstood. You think that, oh, black people are lazy. They're not trying hard enough. And the reality is things are harder for black people. And in being more understanding, you can understand. Perhaps give black people more opportunities. There's so much wrong with the world, but I think we can start with becoming more understanding in other people. You don't even have to necessarily understand something, but at least treat people fairly. The next question is, if you could eat only one fruit for the rest of your life, what would it be and why? I love fruits. I could eat probably every fruit except bananas. I feel like watermelon is just like drinking water every day. So maybe watermelon, but I also like pineapple and mangoes and stuff, but I feel like eating that every day would get tiring. So I'm probably gonna say watermelon. School year, age, major, in country a junior right now i am 20 years old my major is communications and the country i live in is the united states of america there's nothing to brag about my fave tv shows okay so i love shows that i feel like low-key depict, depict what's really going on in the world so i like the 100 quantico scandal um i love girlfriends that's like one of my favorite shows right now even though i finished it and it was really disappointing a lot of favorite shows i don't really have just one so that's just a few that I named my favorite food my favorite food is pasta I like all types of pasta except lasagna I don't really like lasagna like that but I also like seafood but I don't like to say seafood is my favorite food because it's just like I like crab and I like shrimp I don't like mussels I don't like calamari I don't like all the extra other stuff so it's just like can I really say that's my favorite food so I'm probably gonna say that pasta is my favorite food what motivates you I think this is a really good question and we get a real deep Sammy asking this question Miss Ma'am so what motivates me is um where I want to see myself in the future where I want my family to be I always thought I always said that I just want to be a billionaire so I can take care of everybody else around me but I guess you don't necessarily have to be a billionaire to do that so if I could just obtain the amount of money or whatever I want to be in life to take care of others around me then I'll be fine and that's my motivation one of my favorite things to do is paint or cook or bake I just like to create new things, whether that be a photo shoot or whether that be me in the kitchen or whether that be me actually drawing something out. I think I'm really creative in that aspect or even making new videos that I think I'm a real creative person and I like to show that in my work. Okay, so this was my little getting to know me video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Comment, like, and subscribe. If there's anything else you guys want to know about me, just comment down below. And thanks for watching. I am Khadija LaBelle.